of the daughters of Mary Helpon Christians. As a superior, she proved herself apt in spiritual training and guidance, and she had the particular charisma of a happy and reassuring tranquility, radiating joy and involving other young girls in a commitment to the education of the girls. She left to her daughters an educational tradition permeated by evangelical guidelines, the search for God known through enlightened catechesis and burning love, responsibility in work, sincerity and humility, austerity of life, and joyful self-giving. She died at Nitsa Monferrato on 14th May 1881. She was beatified by Pope Pius XI in 1938 and Pope Pius XII canonized her on 24th June 1951. As we take part in this Eucharistic celebration, let us pray for all of us and for the daughters of Mary Help of Christians that we may be able to continue the legacy left by our mother and co-founders Saint Mary the Son and the Spirit. Amen. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit. The month of May is a great month for Salesians and the Salesian family because in this month we celebrate the feast of Dominic Savio the feast of Saint Mary Dominica Mazzarello, feast of Saint Luis Morione, of Saint Leonard Muriardo, and to culminate it all, we celebrate the feast of Mary and the Christians. Therefore, it is very important to reflect on the spirituality and goodness that Mary Mazzarello offers to the Salesian family. A reading from the book of Revelation. After this, I heard what seemed to be the love of a great multitude in heaven, saying, Alleluia, salvation and glory and power to our Lord. A reading from the letter of St. Paul to the Corinthians. Consider your own God, brothers and sisters. Not many of you were wise by human standards. spelled out in four stages of the fall of holiness. May holy therefore these gifts we pray while setting down your spirit upon them like the new fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you, in memory of me.
Thank you, sister. 